We are 55 feet above sea level. Doesn't seem that high, but when you're, uh, when you're right on the water, it is. So um, this is the very top uh, peak. Uh, this is, so right below us is the auditorium right here. So as you can see, uh, Corona Steel's uh, put a lot of hard work in here. Um, all the balcony uh, stuff is up and all the catwalk stuff is up. So uh, lots of little parts and pieces that these guys have been putting together in here. Um, it takes a lot of time uh, to get this stuff put together. Uh, here relatively shortly, we're going to be placing our slab on metal deck uh, for our elevated seating and, uh, and lots of handrail going up in here. So right here in the northwest side of our building, um, uh, there's some acoustically uh, sealed rooms right in this area. Uh, it's really easy access for our musicians to just sneak right in here. Um, so these acoustically sealed rooms uh, provide exactly what they need for uh, tuning their instruments and things like that. If we want to sneak upstairs, let's go upstairs. Uh, this is a beautiful spot right here with uh, two operable partitions. They're air partitions. Uh, in a classroom setting, uh, this area right here is going to seat 400 people. And when it's divided up, uh, a yeah, 100 per room. So we've got a couple trades out here that are chasing each other around the building. Um, the first trade's putting up some glue lambs. The second trade uh, right here behind them is sticking up uh, glazing. So the glazing guys, they're running around this building uh, putting up some mullions and then they fall back. Um, and start uh, just glazing away. Uh, that's the first step of our enclosure up there on top of those glue lambs. So these are our glue lamb timbers. So what these are, these are constructed of multiple pieces of uh, a uh, dimensional lumber uh, that's adhered together to make one structural component. Uh, really nice architectural feature. But these guys are being very diligent in putting these up and this is a finished product. So this is a torch down uh, roofing. This is the first step of our application of our roofing. Um, so on top of this, it gets an insulation and then a TPO on top of that. I'll show you a little bit of that install right up here. Uh, this is uh, complete with that torch down, uh, the insulation, uh, the tapered insulation, and then uh, the TPO roof. So all the boots installed over uh, all the fall protection, uh, drains installed. Uh, it reflects any of the sun stuff. It keeps a, a Hey, a good cool building inside there and then it's extremely durable um, so when these guys put walk pads up here and that type of stuff and they get access to different things um, you know this product really really holds up so this is the final piece of the puzzle out here uh, this is the infiltration gallery for all of our underground utilities so all of our rainwater and stuff like that's going to gather right down here um, so all of our rain leaders are hooked up the roof drains are installed uh, it's all going to flow into a manhole and then into this, which is going to perk into the ground and it's going to minimize the water that runs out to the street. So Jamestown Excavation is here doing this work. Uh, I mean, these guys have been a real pleasure to work with uh, for the duration of this job. So uh, this is a pretty neat milestone for them, the last few pieces uh, for them to complete. So we really appreciate you guys stopping by and make sure you tune in next time for the next construction update video. Uh, but in the meantime, we got things to do. You guys got to get out of here so we can get them done. Uh, thanks. Have a great day.